Hey everybody, Mr. Macintosh here and Mac OS Monterey Beta is here. I know you want to jump in and test it and I'm going to show you in this video how to quickly download the entire full installer in one click. Then I'm going to show you how to install it to a USB flash drive in under five minutes. We got a lot to cover. Let's jump in and get started. Now the first thing we need to do is download the full installer so we can get started. Now I would also recommend enrolling into the SeedUtil which basically enrolls you into the Mac OS Monterey Beta. I'm going to put a link above this video that shows you how to enroll into the beta and then get software updates all throughout the whole beta cycle until the final version comes out. But you don't need to do that right away, you can do that after. So let's show you how to download the full installer in one click. So this page here that I created is going to be a database of all the Mac OS Monterey Monterey full installers from the final version when it comes out to all the beta versions then it's probably going to be about 10 of them and there's going to be an entire list of all the links these are directly to Apple servers and it downloads the install assistant.pkg so all you need to do is click on this link and it'll download the a full package down to your downloads folder and you can see it right here in the downloads all you got to do is click on it here and it'll walk you through an install assistant what it's going to do is it's going to unpack the full Mac OS Monterey beta installer app and put it into your applications folder. Now I've got the applications folder here so you can actually see the installer put the full installer right into the applications folder. So we'll click continue and install here. We'll enter in our password and hit install software. And under a second here, we'll see it install right to the applications folder. And look at that, in no time flat, there's your full Mac OS 12 beta installer. Now that we have that, it's time to build the USB flash drive. Okay, now that we have our full installer, now we can create our USB flash drive. But the first thing we need to do is erase it in macOS extended journal format. So let's plug in our drive here. And then we'll, while we're waiting it for, to mount, we'll open up disk utility. Here's your internal hard drive and it's gonna show under here. And there's our external drive. We can click on the root of the drive. Make sure if you have files on here, they are backed up somewhere else. And then all you need to do is hit erase and it cannot be APFS. It has to be macOS extended journal for the installer to make it bootable. We'll click erase on that. We'll give it a second here. And that's done. We'll click done and we'll close disk utility. Now we're ready to go. So this is going to be super simple. All we need to do is open up the terminal app, which is located in applications utilities folder. And then we can type in sudo because we have to run this as an administrator, type in a space. Then we can go back to the applications window and drag over the install macOS Monterey application. Then we have to arrow back to the end of app, do a forward slash, we're gonna do autocomplete. So you type in a letter for C for contents, capital C, and then click tab to autocomplete it, capital R for resource, tab to autocomplete it, and then create install media. And then tab to autocomplete. And there's the entire command in under 10 seconds. Now all you need to do is do a space dash dash volume to say, hey, where are we going to install the Mac OS Monterey 2? And we're gonna drag our USB freshly erased flash drive to the window and we've got the entire command ready to go. Hit enter, we'll enter in our account password, hit enter. And it's going to say, one final warning, are you sure you wanna erase the drive? We'll hit Y for yes and hit enter. And it's going to go through and erase the disk one more time and then it's gonna make the disk bootable and it's gonna start copying the files. If you wanna see what's going on, during this all you need to do is open up the activity monitor here and we can drag this over here and then click on the disk tab and you can see how fast the system is writing files to the USB flash drive. And right now it's writing about 21 megabytes a second. So it's gonna to have to copy over about 12 gigabytes. So depending on the speed of your drive, it will take anywhere between five minutes and about 15 to 20 minutes. Okay, the copy is complete. As you can see, it says the install media is now available volumes install Mac OS 12 beta. Now I wanna show you one more cool little fun tip before we go. If you wanna change the icon on the USB flash drive, you can open it up like this you can click on mac os 12 beta do command i you'll see the information click on the icon do a command c to copy then click on the usb flash drive again do a command i to look at the information in there click on the drive do a command v to paste it and there you've got your icon and that's installing and downloading mac os big sur onto your usb flash drive the next video that i'm going to do i'm going to talk about all the ways we can install mac os 
12 Monterey Beta from upgrade to a fresh and erase install to an install in a second partition if you don't want to mess with your main installer. And finally, I'll show you how to install it on a separate USB hard drive and boot to it. We'll catch you in the next one. Thanks.